So we've been pretty surprised at the number of kittens that are still coming into the shelter this time of year. Usually by now that, that population has slowed down a little bit, but we're still seeing underage kittens. We are still sending them into foster care and they are still returning to the shelter. And Munster is just one example. He came in as an underage kitten, five to six weeks old back in August. So now he is about 12 weeks old um, and he has been in foster care. So. A lot of times, and you'll hear me say this repeatedly, that people come into the shelter looking specifically for kittens that have been in foster care. They've had great experiences prior, they know how social they are, they know how friendly they are, they know how healthy they are, and they know how they uh, behave in a home environment. So this little guy is Munster. He is a gorgeous, just your classic black and white domestic short hair. He's almost four pounds. Prior to leaving here, he will be microchipped, neutered, he is current on all vaccines, tested negative for feline leukemia and feline immunodeficiency virus, um, part of the adoption process. Uh, one of the questions that we get is how long does it take to adopt one of these adorable little kittens? And usually two to three days. Um, the, the reason for the delay primarily is that we spay and neuter all of the kittens prior to leaving the shelter. So that sometimes um, causes a, just a couple of days delay, but usually within 48 hours, 72 hours, um, one, from the time you put in an adoption application, we will have a kitten ready to go. So again, this is Munster. If you have been waiting patiently and now is a good time for you to adopt kittens, I highly recommend that you show up to the shelter and just visit because we've got a number of them available for adoption.